Let's create a connection between Bloomerang and Eventbrite using Zapier. In this example, I'm using a template in Zapier that creates a donation in Bloomerang when a new attendee registers in Eventbrite. I'm also using another template in Zapier that creates an interaction in Bloomerang when an attendee checks in with Eventbrite. Here's an Eventbrite page that's selling tickets to an online book club event. Constituents can purchase tickets here and enter information for each attendee. Whether or not those attendees were constituents in Bloomerang before, we'll be able to pull them in and see them in Bloomerang later. Here in Bloomerang, I can see the donation on the purchaser's timeline. When I click on the donation, I can see the date, the amount of all of the tickets. I can also see the fund, campaign, and appeal that have been mapped from Eventbrite to show up here. I'm also pulling in the note here at the bottom. And here we've got the ticket quantity. It was mapped from Eventbrite to a transaction custom field in Bloomerang. Now let's fast forward a little bit to the day of the event. These attendees are present, so let's go ahead and check them in at Eventbrite. Now let's head back to the purchaser's timeline in Bloomerang. We've got a new interaction here showing that they have checked in to the event. There's also an interaction for the other attendee. This isn't the purchaser, they're just the attendee. We were able to pull them in as well. And you can see that we're pulling in the subject, a note, purpose, and channel for the event.